Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. My name is Lucia and this is Lulu's Leaves. In today's video, I am going to be showing you guys around Secret Garden Boutique. It is a Saturday, so that means lots of new plants are coming out on the shelves. So I did want to show you guys around. I want to also let you know I am in the shop by myself. That is why I'm not wearing a mask. So don't worry, masks are required in this store. So bring your mask if you want to come shop. But let's get straight on into the tour. I really hope you guys are going to enjoy it. Actually, I know you guys are going to enjoy it. So let's just get straight on into it. Start off here with this beautiful philodendron white princess. These guys are super popular right now, and this one is really nicely variegated. This guy is 420, really beautiful. And then we've also got some really cute little baby tie constellations, and these guys are 280, really, really nice. They've even got some sectoral variegation rather than just the splashing that you see on most. Um, Thai constellation, so that's really really nice. And then these beautiful variegated Anthurium vitarifoliums. These are so so cool. They're four hundred dollars. I think that is, yeah, that's the price all around. Um, but these guys are really really cool. They've had them before, but they were a little bit bigger and a little bit more expensive. So this is a really good option for um, just a smaller size. And there are a few of those. They're all really, really nice. And then here, they've also got this beautiful Monstera Stanleyana Aurea. So this is the yellow variegated um, Stanleyana. And I wish I could afford this, it's so pretty. And it is 360, so nice. And then these Philodendron Lupinums as well. Those are fun, all with new growth there. These guys are 180. I absolutely love this Anthurium for Getty Eye. I think it's so, so cute. This one is 200. Really, really nice. I don't know what form this is, but it might be the dark form, it might be the silver. I'm not 100% sure. And then this beautiful Syndapsis Lucens. These guys are becoming really, really popular right now. They are so cool and pillowy. They're also super frosty. This guy is 180. And then there's this Monstera Siltipicana, which are really, really cool, especially when they get large. These guys are 140. There's only one of this guy though. And then this beautiful Alocasia um, Odora Aria, I believe. Yeah, that's what it is. This guy is 160. And then in Anthurium Vichii, you guys know I love the Vichii's, and this one is not labeled. I believe it's three, 380, something like that, maybe 320, I can't remember the exact price, but it's within the 300 range. And then here, there's some Syndapsis Blue. These guys are amazing, they're 130. There's a few of those. They are really, really cool. You can see the blue more on this one here, but they just get a really nice uh, silvery hue, which in the plant world is considered a blue. And then here there's a little immature Epipremnum skeleton key. This one is $200, really, really cool. These guys get super interesting looking when they're mature. So definitely look that up if you guys don't know what they look like. And then some Brantianum here. These guys are $90. There are four of these guys, looking really, really nice. They also get really cool when they're mature. They get more elongated, 
not like a melanocrysum, but similar to like a medium um, mature <laughs> melanocrysum, if that makes sense. And then some jewel orchids here, I believe. Uh, this one is that. I'm not gonna even attempt that name. <laughs> um, but this guy is $30. They're really, really cool. They've got some silver striping on them. There's two of those guys. This one's 25. And then some beautiful Ludicia Discolor. Really, really nice. These guys are 30. And then this Ludicia Spider-Man here. This is $50. This is a really, really nice size though. I don't know if you guys can tell on camera, but it's pretty big. Lots of variegated string of hearts. This is also really interesting. This is a reverted strawberry shake. So it definitely was a strawberry shake. We saw that it was variegated, but it decided to revert. So now it is being sold as a reverted one. And this guy is, I believe 200. Uh, oh, 120, 120, nice. And then we've got some string of turtles. This is Peperomia prostrata for $10, a few of those. There's also some Cebu Blue. This small guy here is $15. And then if you want a more mature version with some fenestrations and more leaves, um, this guy's 120, really nice. This guy's super cute too. And then a small Monstera Peru. I think this is finally one of the last Perus that are available here. And this is $20. Also Rifidophora tetrasperma. This guy is $10. Some variegated string of pearls for $25. And then a uh, Serapegia Silver Glory. This guy is $15 some pixie syngoniums for eight dollars these are really really cute and they stay miniature like that and then some mini watermelon peperomia for ten dollars some peperomia quito these guys i believe they're uh, 15 yeah they're a little bit more uncommon and then up here is the other monstera peru this one is a lot bigger and really really nice i believe this is sixty dollars yeah this is sixty dollars been here for a little bit, but I think it's such a great price and really, really nice. And then up here, there's also a philodendron billy tie for 160. The leaves are a really nice size on this one too, if that's something you're looking for. And then some really nice ZZ Ravens. These guys are $22. They've all got some, I wouldn't say all, but they definitely have some new growth on some of them there that are nice and neon. And then some Alocasia Buddha's Temple. These are really, really interesting actually. I have only seen them as of recently. And these guys are $12, so a really, really great price. But they've got really interesting texture on the leaves. And then some Neon Pothos there. These guys are $12. Some Philodendron Tanu for $135. And then some philodendron floridas. These are not the ghosts, so these will not get white leaves, um, but they still have that same shape to them, so that's really cool. And these guys are $80. This Anthurium metallicum here is 300. Really, really nice. So is this guy here. I love those leaves. There's also a few El Chaco reds. There are three of them here. I. We'll check the price. This guy here is 300. It is so, so nice. I love that. And then 300, I believe they're all 300. Yeah, all 300. So you get your pick at kind of what you like. And then some Anthurium boracuinums. These guys all have new growth too, which is really nice. They are 380. And then an Epipremnum panatum albo. I love this guy. And this one is 200. And then there are some vanilla planifolias. This one is variegated here. These are um, 100 for the variegated ones. And then 80 for the not variegated ones. And then some Anthurium bakerii. These are 120. 
This is kind of similar to the Vitara folium. Then if we head down here, we have a gorgeous Monstera Albo Variegata. This guy, I believe this might be a Deliciosa, but we don't really know until they get mature. This guy is 780 here. And then we've also got this beautiful Golden Dragon. I love these guys. They are 240. They're like little bushes here. There's a few leaves on each of them that are really, really nice. And then this beautiful, larger Philodendron Melanochrysum. I love this plant. And this one is only 180. That's a really great price. And then some gorgeous Philodendron Burl Marks. These guys are variegated, really nicely variegated at that. And they're only 150. I love this guy. Really nice, bright colors and contrast. Look at that leaf. And then some Philodendron Pastizanum. These guys are 180. And this one has a new leaf there. This one also has new leaves, really beautiful. Some Philodendron Florida Ghosts. These are really nice. This is 145 for the small guy with the really nice white minty leaves. And then this bigger guy here is 160. So really, really nice contrast between the leaves. We've also got these Monstera Sub Pinatas. These are really fun and they are $50. And then lots of little Anthuriums here. This is the Doriaki. This guy is 240. And then some Anthurium Magnificum Hybrids. These are also really, really nice and they are 190. Some more Doriaki for 240. Silver Blush for 190. And then some Syngoniums, my favorites right now. This is the Syngonium Freckles. There are two of those and they are 140 each. And then there's some Syngonium Pink Splashes here that are also really nice. Some of them have these nice mature tri-lobed leaves and these guys are 140. Also the Syngonium Three Kings. These guys have really beautiful variegation. This one here is 150. And then they've also got this elusive <laughs> um, strawberry ice Syngonium and this is $300. You can see that variegation there. And then some Philodendron Mames. This one is 265. It's a really great size. And then 165 for the smaller guy. I think this guy, yeah, also 165. This is a Monstera Pinata Partita for 150. And then some Amidria Medium Green. This guy's 180, or sorry, not 180, 80. <laughs> and then uh, I believe these are also, yeah, also $80 for these guys. And then here's some Philodendron Heteraceum. I love these guys, they're looking so healthy. And these are in a six inch pot for $25. Rattlesnake Calathea here for 20. And then some of the Calathea Magic Stars as well. These are $20. Some Philodendron Moonlight for $10. And this larger Lemon Lime, I believe, for 20 or 25. And then over here on the other side, there are some cool begonias. Yeah, these are the begonia listata, really, really cool. I'll show you guys these close up because they're super fuzzy, really cute. And then there are some butterworts in there. Also a philodendron Burl Marks Fantasy. That guy there is 200. And then a small little uh, Ludicia Spider-Man. I believe those guys are 20. And then here's some Hoya pot of gold or Macrophylla pot of gold. Really, really nice. There's two of those guys and they are $48. And then some of these um, really beautiful Hoya AH074 silver. These guys are 240. They both have multiple leaves and new growth. So they are definitely ready to go. Really, really nice. And then some Hoya Latifolia. These are really nice. There's two of them here and they are uh, 120. And then lots of assorted Hoyas here. I might miss a few, but you'll be able to see them all. There's some uh, Lacunosa Silver here, some regular Lacunosa, 
Densifolia, Rotundiflora, Elliptica, and uh, some Biakensis, some Australis Lisa here. These guys all range from 25 to like $40. So that's kind of the price range for most of the Hoyas. And then there are some larger Obscuras for $50. Some Comingianas here. These guys are 25. And some Sigillatus also. This is a smaller one here. And then Erythrostemma. These are really cool. I love the subtle veining on these. This one's also really cool here. What's this called? This is the Bermanica. Bermanica. <laughs> uh, really cool. It's kind of similar to the Polyneura in the fishtail shape. And then there are some Mani Parensis here. And over here, some Pubicalyx Pink Silver and some Albo Marginata, the Macrophylla. And then also some gorgeous Hoya Matildes. These are pretty nice and big. There's even a little peduncle there on that one for 45. Some more of the erythro, uh, erythrostemma here. These ones are 45. Then if we come down here, there's a really nice assortment of begonias. This is the autumn ember. These are all $20 by the way. This is the bandit and then Soli Mutata, which are really striking. This is the Begonia Immense, the Begonia Nagara Tense, and what is this one called? I can't remember what this one's called, but it is also really, really cool. Look how big they are too. They're a really, really nice size. And then some Ficus Rubies here. Some dark burgundy rubber plants as well. And then lots of beautiful Mandula pothos here. This one is gorgeous. These guys are um, ranging in price. This one here is $60. And then these smaller ones are $40. So you definitely have some options. And then some really nice Syndapsis Pictus Argerius for $15. Then up on the top here, there's also some Hoya Carnosa Crimson Princess. Those are really nice. I believe these guys are 65 or something like that. This is the Compacta here. Some really nice Caladiums. These are really nice for spring, summertime. They do well outside too. Some Sansevieria Whale Fins. And then the Philodendron Bloody Mary. This plant is so nice. I think they're so fun. They're a really nice dupe for the Dark Lord as well. And these are only 45 for that larger size. Some Philodendron Birkins for $40. These are just nice big bushes of Birkins. <laughs> Some Philodendron Penduriforme. <laughs> a little funky of a name. Um, they're really cool. They're similar to the Bipenifolium. Then some Scandopsis pictus exotica. They're on little trellises, which is really cute. And then this really nice Alocasia poly. And then up here at the front, there's this big Philodendron giganteum. This one here is $80. And then some Monstera deliciosas with tons of new growth on them. This guy's also really cool. I think this is, uh, what is this? I can't even remember. Um, maybe the Black Cardinal, not 100% sure, but it's really nice and full. Then the Philodendron Subhestatum as well for $80. Lots of assorted begonias and apicias in the front here. These are $15 for the begonias. And then I believe $6 for the apicias. Also this um, pink Valentine Aglionema, it's actually flowering, which is really, really cool. And then some Ficus Audrey, some more Moonlight here, and some Variegated Giganteums. These guys are 200, and that is pretty much it.
All right, guys, well, that's going to be it for me. Thank you so much for watching this video, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.